So, I'm with the coach, Alex Coxon. Yeah. Yeah, so how are you doing? How, like, after the after the game tonight, is there anything uh, to take away from the game tonight specifically? Maybe you want to work on specifically just about the game? Yeah, just disappointed because of the results. But I like the I like the feeling that I have with the player of the second half. They fight very, very hard for the at 10, 10 players. And I think they did that they can. It was difficult that we did pack in yeah. the game. But that's, that's football, you know, you cannot control that. We have different plans and we yeah. have to change. We have to change. So, in retrospect, uh, in the entire first season, um, how do you feel about just how the team showed up and, you know, showed up all the time you know, for the practices as well as the game? Yeah, exactly that. Like I said in the, the locker room, I'm very proud and honored to coach this team, this young kid. Because they are young, we were only 11 weeks all together, and the result is pretty good that time, I think. Because after 11 weeks, the players didn't play uh, each other uh, together before. I think it's a, it's a it's nice inside. But the results are not here, it will be for the next day. Yeah, yeah, for sure. So, um, moving forward, is there uh, anything that, uh, that the Centennial fans can look forward to? The what, sorry? So, moving forward into the next season in spring, is there anything for the fans to look forward to? Oh, uh, yes, we will be better for sure. More structure. Uh, I think the team will change a little bit. Maybe different players too that uh, we are looking for. But uh, the spirit of the club will be uh, stronger and stronger for the, for, the, for the spring season. Yeah, for sure. Okay. All right, thank you very much. Thank you. All right, keep playing hard. Yeah, go San Diego.